What up, YouTube? It's your boy Red Ape, man. Back with that part two on that sun gazing. My experiences with sun gazing, man. Um, well, first off, I want to say it was a number of things that I was doing during this process. First off. Second thing I want to say is as far as should you sun gaze, hell yeah. Especially if you serious about trying to, you know, get more in touch with yourself and and, and, and you're, you're looking for more clarity in your life. You're looking for more, um, mm, you're just looking for something, man. Sun gazing, man, is a good way to help bring those thoughts together and, um, you know, help you focus, man. And, Man, jeez, whoa, like, I mean, probably one of the best forms of meditation for someone who can't sit there quietly and meditate on their own. Sun gazing, I would say, is the best way for someone who is trying to develop the character to be able to um, patiently sit there and, you know, hypnotically put themselves in a state of uh, subconsciousness to take, you know, to take themselves into another plane so that they could, you know, relax, I guess, you know. I mean, uh, fuck, I could explain that a little differently, but I'll just, whatever. Hopefully y'all follow me on that. Um, but yeah, man, my, I, you know, when I first started sun gazing, at the time I had a job where, um, I was already up when the sun when the sun came up and when the sun was going down I was I was somewhere where I could be around the sun as well so you know um, I had a lot of opportunities to sun gaze and and to take it seriously especially at the proper times sunset sunrise you know um, even you know I, I would get stronger as time time would go on and I would attempt to sun gaze at other times. But that's something, you know, you got to you gotta build your way up. You know what I'm saying? Like, crawl before you walk. Crawl before you walk. But any goddamn way. I remember, uh, you know, there was just a lot of thoughts and a lot of things I had going on in my mind. A lot of shit going on, you know what I'm saying? And um, I had a lot of, uh, you know, thoughts come into my mind, especially during this, this phase of me, uh, you know, sun gazing, man, not even a phase, it's something I still do very frequently, but I stumbled across just a lot of information, man, and, um, I want to say that, you know, sun gazing took a lot of part in that, and, uh, you know, meditation as well, and, you know, yoga, and just a lot of things that just loosen my body up from all the restraint that, uh, was compelling me from being able to reach certain compartments in my mind. And I would say that the sun gazing definitely helped, you know, uh, it, like I said, it, it just helped clear things up, like for real, man. It, you know, <sighs> I remember after sun gazing one time, I went inside of my uh, bathroom to uh, meditate, and I actually did a little bit of uh, yoga, kundalini, and um, I went inside the bathroom just to do a little meditating in a dark room. There was no no light that could sh shine in this room at all. I had towels and all kinds of shit to block out all light, and uh, I was in there for about 45 minutes. And the whole entire time, my body was vibrating like a motherfucker, first off. And, um, you know, I just kept channeling the energy, kept channeling the energy upwards. I, You know, I don't, I don't want to go into detail on how I was doing it. I just was channeling it up. And um, before I knew it, I just couldn't keep my eyes closed anymore. Like, I kept trying to keep my eyes closed, but I couldn't keep them closed any longer. And I opened my eyes in this dark ass room, which before I opened my eyes previous to me putting all the towels up and making sure that there was no light coming in, 
I couldn't even see my own damn hand. That's how goddamn dark it was in this room. But when I opened up my eyes in a dark ass room where I couldn't see my hand, when I first stepped in the room, there was this dark matter floating in front of me. Okay? I mean, just all in front of me, just just there. Looking at me, man. Just there. Like, and I knew, I was conscious enough to understand that it came out of me. It wasn't, well, you know, <laughs> that, 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 that one there, I have to, I have to, you know, dig a little deeper on to actually really come to the, the, the bottom of that. But anyways, the dark matter was in front of me and, um, the way it seemed, at least, it seemed as if there was too much melanin inside of me at that moment that forced the dark matter out. And it was almost like there was a force field that was built around me that stopped the dark matter from even being able to deal with me or uh, leech on to me. You know, and like I said, I, 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 ugh, man, I mean, you know, this was mind blowing, you know, but it was an eye opener because this was some shit that I used to see when I was a kid. You know what I'm saying? I used to see this type of shit when I was young, man, like trying to go to sleep. You know what I'm saying? After watching TV or some shit, you know what I'm saying? Mom, like, yeah, go to sleep. It's time to go to bed. Like, I'm ready to go to bed. But I'm as I'm sitting in this dark ass room, I see dark matter floating all over the goddamn room. You know what I'm saying? And, I haven't seen nothing like this type of shit since I've been a kid, man. So, you know, it was, you know, as, as far as my spiritual journey has taken me, I've always known that, you know, if you start experiencing some of the emotions and, and, and things that you were experiencing as a kid, you're heading in the right goddamn direction, okay? So... I knew I was on the right path, man, and I was I was ecstatic, man. I was I was excited, you know. Um, I had many other other experiences, man. That it's too long to just put into this one video. Um, but I just I just you know like I say, man, I really just want to talk about like I just wanted to talk about it and just share my advice on on it and, or my opinion on it and what I think if I think you should partake in it. You know, uh, ever since I started sun gazing, you know, the highlights in my hair has, uh, you know, came out more. Um, shit, man. Like I say, I'm, um, you know, my attitude and anger has suppressed on a level unexplainable. You know, just, just so many, just so many beautiful benefits. Just sun gazing, man. I mean, ever since I started, I mean, my life has gotten better. It has not gotten worse. You know, things have have been brought to the light. Like, you know, they just have. You know, so it's time to just get rid of the fear, man. Get the fear out your mind and do what you got to do, man, to better yourself, man. If some type of information stumbles across your path, don't turn it down. Look into it. It might benefit you in ways you can never even imagine. Take out the time to take a second look. This shit got red. Overstand if you came across this video, it was meant for you. You 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 linked up your frequency, tuned the fuck in with a guy, with your guy, and we on the same wave beat. You know what I mean? We on the same wavelength. Or you trying to, you know, walk a path that I'm walking, and you know, shit is shit is looking lovely. You know what I mean? Like shit is starting to look lovely, man. Slowly but surely over time. You know what I'm saying? I mean, it was never looking down. It was never looking down. Just my perception or the angle I was looking at had me looking at things down. Then I changed the way I looked at it, and everything was all on the come up. <laughs> Red 8, yo. Signing the fuck out. Like, subscribe. I got some more shit coming soon. Some good info that I promise you, you would just, I mean, it, 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 that's, that, it definitely could help you. Uh, you can learn from my mistakes, you know what I'm saying? Uh, you ain't got to do some of the shit that I done did. This is the whole point of this, you know? 
speed up the process for you, man. Like, so yeah, man. Signing out. You know, bringing some information you should check out. Yo, shouts to the thirteenth son. You know, he he was a nigga that um helped clarify some things, man, on the sun gazing thing for me as well. You know, when I first initially started. Uh, sun gazing. He wasn't the one that got me started on it, but he was definitely a person that helped me um, feel more comfortable about it. You know, the Thirteenth Son, man. Yo, go check him out, man. He 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 speak on some good shit, man. For real. I mean, Red Ape signing out. Shouts to all the other people out there teaching, man. I mean, I see y'all, man. It's all motivation, man. It's all love on my end too. I say to your day.